Reaction is coming in after federal agents raided the homes of Sean Diddy Combs. Sources say it's part of a trafficking investigation into the music mogul. Eyewitness News reporter Darla Miles is following developments from the newsroom. Darla. Well, Lauren, this investigation is being led by the U.S. Attorney's Office in the Southern District of New York here uh, in Lower Manhattan. And we've just learned that they've been interviewing alleged victims and witnesses for the last few months. Combs was in Miami at the time of the raid and is cooperating with this investigation. Homeland Security agents seizing electronics from the Miami and Los Angeles homes of Sean Diddy Combs in simultaneous cross-country raids executed Monday afternoon. This chopper video shows federal agents loading up cardboard box after cardboard box into vehicles. Also seen from above, SWAT teams and agents with long guns. So I think what's happening here is we're looking for the laptops, we're looking for all that information, but we're also looking to try to corroborate any of the allegations that we've seen in these civil lawsuits. While no criminal charges have been filed against the 54-year-old, a federal investigation has been underway for several months into alleged human trafficking. He's recently been the subject of several civil lawsuits, the music mogul accused of sex trafficking and abuse, allegations he vehemently denies. In an Instagram post pinned at the top of his ex feed, he says, enough is enough, saying sickening allegations have been made against me by individuals looking for a quick payday. Let me be absolutely clear, I did not do any of the awful things being alleged. In November, Diddy settled a lawsuit with his ex-girlfriend of 10 years, Cassie Ventura, just one day after she filed an explosive civil lawsuit under the New York Survivors Act for $30 million. Upon hearing the news about the federal search warrants executed Monday at both homes, her attorney released a statement saying, hopefully this is the beginning of a process that will hold Mr. Combs responsible for his depraved conduct. And the allegations made in these civil lawsuits by Ventura and others is what has triggered this federal investigation. And at this point, it is unclear if he has a home here in New York City that might be a part of this probe.